What happens with Xamarin Traditional when .NET 6 and .NET MAUI come around? You'll find out in this episode of Quick Questions. So the question is, what is going to happen whenever .NET 6 come around and .NET MAUI come around? What is going to happen with Xamarin Traditional? So Xamarin Traditional is like the, the iOS and the Android bindings for like all the APIs that live inside iOS and Android. So that allows you to write C sharp code, but still build applications for iOS and Android, as I've mentioned already a couple of times now. So that is by basically like, you know, forms will just add that layer on top where you don't have to worry about all the, the APIs of those platforms or the, the UI of those platforms. But if you still want to write kind of like the native apps and don't mind writing it for Android and iOS, you will still have that more fine grained control. You will have access to all the APIs. Um, Xamarin Forms and .NET MAUI has all of that. But if you like to do that, traditional um, programming like that, you definitely can. And the beauty is in .NET 6, you can still continue to do that because I think like Xamarin.iOS and Xamarin.Android will be renamed to um, .NET for iOS and .NET for Android, I think. And the cool thing is that is the only thing that changes, only the name changes. Because if you've worked with Xamarin Traditional before, you will know that all the namespaces in there already kind of mirror the namespaces in iOS and in Swift and in Objective-C and um, Android and all the languages that come together with that, Java. So it already has those namespaces. So porting your code over is just a um, thing of like, you know, say I want to use .NET 6 now and boot everything still works because the namespaces and everything is still the same. So the conversion from one to another should be pretty simple. There will be a try convert tool, um, at least for Xamarin Forms to .NET MAUI. Hopefully that will also come for like the Xamarin traditional um, things. But um, again, I think, you know, you just have to change your, uh, well, just, you know, it's, it can be a hassle. Let's be honest. Um, your solution file and your csproj file to work with .NET 6. But other than that, all your code should um mostly hopefully work so that's what's going to happen with xamarin traditional it will go nowhere actually in fact your transition will be very easy and you will automatically get all the benefits from dotnet 6 and that's what's going to happen with xamarin traditional